if you're a Pele practitioner or whether your family believes in Pele because of, of the same tradition or whether you're a hula dancer and, and perform those chants or dances to her, you need to come out, you need to come in the open, you need to take a position, you need to influence your families, you need to influence your friends and your communities to support the claims of those who live closer to Pele, next to Pele, have always had this tradition to Pele, have not lost it. So it's, it's my appeal as a kumuhula to other kumuhulas who are out there and who utilize the, these kinds of uh, vegetation, who still have the practice of making your own laser, teaching your haumana how to make their own laser, and teaching your haumana the connection of these vegetation to the different uh, deities of the hula. It's, it's my appeal to you as teachers to, to replant or to malama, to take care of these things, the greenery of, of the forest, the greenery that is Hawaiian, so that our children that will come the generation after us will have these things. This energy of geothermal belongs to a deity. It belongs to a deity that has lived for hundreds of years and has been the only deity that has come down to us for many generations and is still very much alive, still very much visible, still very much worshipped and thought of and believed at at all different levels and respected. And if all of the things around us which they have taught us to, to respect, the forest, the ocean, the, the eruption, the, the fact that, that Pele lives, all of these things around us die, then they die and I die as a Hawaiian. And I think this generation has got to realize a lot of things that we got to hang on to or we just won't be Hawaiians. You know, to me, being Hawaiian nowadays is one of the hardest things to do. To, to be Hawaiian, you gotta be the way they tell you to be. You cannot be the way your ancestors tell you to be, or your tutus tell you to be, or, your, you, or an intelligent Hawaiian know how you're supposed to be. Pele's power is not ours to have to share. It belongs to her. She's not for sale. She's not for tapping. She needs to exist in, in, in her pure form. She's alive and she's active. And she needs to stay that way. She needs to have her time on Hawaii. She needs to live off, and we need to live off with her our time. <laughs>